Okay, so today's video is gonna be on uh, some lawn tractor maintenance and just uh, fixing some stuff that uh, broke on it. So here we go. already loosened up all the, the bolts on here. This is where your air filter is. And I just replaced this one not too long ago. So it should still be in pretty good shape, which yeah, it looks pretty decent. That still looks pretty good. You got this one underneath it. That, that looks pretty good. And that area right there is also where you'll find where out like if you're in the country or wherever uh, mice will build their nests in there. I've had that happen to me a couple times where they ate up the filter and made it into a nest in there. That was a new battery last year and had it on the trickle charger the whole winter so it's it's been holding good and still working next thing we want to do is replace this fuel filter then we'll go ahead and do an oil change on it hey can i help you well we'll see olaf i'm i'm trying to get the rest of the maintenance done on it Okay, you're pretty close. Well, I just want to help. You know me. Olaf, you try to eat everything that I'm trying to work on. You? Yep. Okay, I want to put on a new baffle. Because um, the old one, uh, I hit a rock or something. And it actually bent the whole thing and it made it go up under so these are meant to be replaced uh, these actually help protect your mower deck uh, from being bent and then if that happens if your mower deck gets bent then your blades won't spin they'll get stuck there so these actually are what prevent it from happening 
and a lot of the times um, this is what will bend back and you'll hear noise like you're digging up your dirt and everything normally it's this piece and it just unbolts right off just takes a simple carriage bolt and a lock washer and it holds it right on I'll show you lines right up like that so There's two. doing oh my god oh boss you are you have no idea what personal space is doing at all at all oh god your breath smells like oh like bigfoot oh well, you didn't give me any toothpaste and a toothbrush well, I'll give you one, that's for sure, because your breath stinks. Oh my God. All right, so that's what holds the baffle on. Those one, two, three, three bolts there with the lock washers. Now I'll just tighten them down. the clippings from there yeah it's nice and dry it's dried out just like hay hmm. something in my toe hmm. Hmm. all right oboe weird goat baffles on there so that's all set okay so what we're gonna do now is the oil change so So here's the new one. You want to take some oil, put it on the rubber seal.
put the new one on. Perfect. So now we're going to add some oil. Now that's closed and we got the new filter in on the other side. Okay, now that we got oil in it, everything's sealed up, got the new filter on, uh, we're going to go ahead and start it and then check the oil level again because oil's going to go into that filter and it's going to drop down a little bit. Okay, now we want to replace that fuel filter. So, this is the new one we got for it. So, your flow with the arrow going this way. So, it's going to go that way. It's going to sit in there just like that. And that's how quick and easy it is to do a fuel filter. All right, the only other thing you, you would do would be to change out the spark plugs, but I just changed them out so those are still good. And other than that, battery's good, air filter's good, new fuel filter, new oil filter, new oil, new vortex baffle and that's it so let's fire her up there was one other thing which i don't know why it didn't come out on the film uh when i was doing the zerk fittings so any fittings on there just make sure that you grease them and for the mower deck and for the mower itself so we're all set it's all tuned up and ready to go so hope you like enjoy subscribe like share and we'll see you later bye